Madam Shaka, for one minute, please. Thank you. The deal on migration that Timmermans rushed through at the most unfortunate moment seems to be the reason why the very dangerous situation in the southeast of Turkey is met with deafening silence from the EU and its member states. And that must end. Many other topics than migration need to be addressed. Human rights and the rule of law. And crucially, the EU must call on the AKP government to return to the peace negotiating table with the PKK and they should end the disproportionate collateral damage on civilians. Terrorism can never be justified, and the democratic path for the Kurdish people in Turkey are the key alternative that must be given room. And when academics call for an end to violence, that is their freedom. It is essential for the EU to find in Turkey a reliable partner as a candidate member state, as a NATO partner, and as an active member of the coalition against ISIS. That should be the priority of targets. And let us make sure and be cautious that counter-terrorism is not used as an excuse to restrict the freedoms and rights of people in Turkey altogether. Thank you. Thank you. For one minute, Madame Vergia. Merci, Madame la Présidente. Depuis plus d'un mois, l'armée turque mène une opération d'une rare violence dans le sud-est de la Turquie, faisant de cette région majoritairement peuplée de Kurdes une zone de guerre avec plus de 50 villes sous couvre-feu. La répression s'abat sur les élus du HDP.